stool, but even more money on Burns, 12 to 1 on to retain his Commonwealth title. Such a brave man up against him. But can he find the answers of what would be? Well, a really unbelievable victory, Michael Gomez. No real signs. Burns three up on my scorecard. Time out. Howard Foster just wants the uh, tape. Retied to the left hand of Michael Gomez. One of his kids is here at ringside. Young Michael. And plenty of sombreros, but there's a quieter feel to the Gomez fan club. Body shots. That's what the corner asked for. He's still listening to them. And the uppercut too. Too fresh, too young, too strong, and Gomez in dire straits here in the opening minute of the seventh round. And Howard Foster says no more. It is a Burns night in Glasgow, and Michael Gomez loses for the tenth time. And the last hurrah might mean the last ring appearance for Michael Gomez after an amazing career. But Ricky Burns tonight proved. That he is a little star in Scotland in ascendancy, still the Commonwealth champion with his biggest scalp to date. Yeah, but now give him so much confidence. A tremendous finish there from Ricky Burns, who just seized his opportunity when it came, when he felt Michael Gomez was starting to wilt and he was quick to jump on him, quick to throw a lot of big punches and get that finish, which obviously. Great reception here. Electric atmosphere all night. It really has been. Your heart goes out to the the trier, the hard man, Michael Gomez. But he didn't have it. He didn't look anything like he once did. It was never going to be a repeat of the Alex Arthur win. No, he just started to push forward, started to push him against the, the ropes, took one or two shots himself, and then the beginning of the end was that big right hand. He just bullied him back and hit him with that. And then he sensed that Gomez was starting to wilt and just kept the punches going in. Excellent finish for Ricky Burns. A real big night for him. And he showed his strength and how much he wants it, how much he wanted to keep that belt. I think there was about 13 unanswered punches there. Howard Foster, beautiful timing. Sad for Michael Gomez, but Ricky Burns, confident, positive, wasn't intimidated. No, he certainly wasn't. He was strong at the end, kept to his word, and he really did go in there and just take everything away from Gomez and got a very good win. The statement that Ricky Burns wanted, needed, and put out tonight in front of this crowd. Ladies and gentlemen, at 47 seconds of round seven, your referee, Howard Foster, has stopped the contest. He deemed that Michael Gomez was in no position to continue. The winner, and still the Commonwealth Super Featherweight Champion from Coatbridge in Scotland, Ricky Burns. Ladies and gentlemen, please.